Hello everyone. Uh, in this example, I'm showing uh, open source code interpreter that's built with Autogen agents and uh, E2B Cloud Sandbox. Uh, this is our community contribution, so credits go to Keegan McCallum, the founder of XLR.ai. I will tag him in the comments. And uh, how is this different from what Autogen normally does? Uh, so if you're familiar with it, it's multi-agent framework and uh, it runs the code output uh, via Docker, uh, which is fine, but it has some limitations. And here in this example, we are doing this code ex execution with uh, Cloud Sandbox, uh, which is isolated cloud environment where you can upload files, you can download files that the LM agent creates, uh, you can access the internet and many other things. Uh, so let's run the program. Uh, so here we are, uh, we gave the agent a simple task to uh, define new function. Uh, and this function will uh, send the request to a given URL and uh, print the response. Uh, so you can see first uh, the agent lists uh, what existing functions are already registered. Uh, since Autogen uses uh, more agents, here are two, uh, the user proxy and the chatbot. Uh, yeah, and so this is the function. And here you can see uh, how the function is executed uh, and we are getting the response. Um, the, the benefit of Autogen is that the agents uh, are reflecting on each other and uh, sometimes making more loops, uh, fixing the code, etc. So uh, we can see this. And again, this is the execution of the code. And we can see it printed uh, the response from the URL. Mm, so of course, this is just a, a simple example to start from. And you can modify what task uh, you give to the agents. Uh, and you can find this example uh, in our open source E2B cookbook. So if you have uh, other idea uh, how to use uh, E2B sandboxes with some cool coding agents, just uh, give us a message and we are happy to revert uh, your work uh, to share your project or anything. So that's it.